I think Paul Moore caught a lot of people in France by surprise when he first entered the Derby picture. He won the Prix Graffel at Saint Cloud, and most of us were there to see the Aga Khan's Vadimar. Paul Moore pulled very hard that day, and by both his jockey and his trainer's admission, he didn't handle the bend at all. But he absolutely flew home in the style of a very good horse. I remember talking to Andre Fab about 20 minutes afterwards, and he said straight away that he thought Paul Moore could be a Derby horse, even without me asking the question. Then it emerged that he was going to bring Paul Moore over for breakfast with the stars in a matter of nine days before the derby. You couldn't say that either Fab or Paul Moore are particularly keen to grab the limelight ahead of a major race, yet there they were going to exercise the horse in front of the media, and then Andre was going to give an interview. The derby itself was just extraordinary. Perhaps one in 20 had won the way that Paul Moore did it. Cormor Donahue on Treasure Beach rode the copybook Johnny Murta, Kieran Fallon type of race, sitting in third or fourth, whereas you couldn't see Paul Moore with a telescope. The last horse I remember coming from that far back was probably Airham. But that's what Fab saw that a lot of other people didn't, because Mikel Barcelona was able to settle a horse so much better off a strong pace, and they knew he would finish. I think the jockey deserves an awful lot of credit too. Barcelona got Paul Moir balanced in the straight when he started lugging into the camber, and then although he got after him, he never really panicked. The salute in the end may have been spontaneous, but I think he knew he was going to get Treasure Beach from about half a furlong out, Paul Moore was travelling that fast. I suppose the question now is what could he have achieved? You would imagine that a first French-trained winner of the Epsom Derby in 35 years would ensure his place in racing history here, but without winning the arc, he won't be rated all that highly. But if André Fab considers Paul Moore one of the best he's trained, then that puts him high up on the list of French middle-distance colts in the last 30 years, 